Do you know about J. Frank Dalton, who said he was Jesse James long after James was killed in 1882? According to Old West historian Ed Bartholomew, Dalton was using the nickname The Kid as far back as 1933. When that didn't work, he claimed to be Deputy U.S. Marshal Frank Dalton, except the real Frank Dalton was killed in a gunfight in 1887. So when that didn't work out, J. Frank Dalton decided he would be Jesse James. Upon going public with his claims, a guy named Rudy Terulli, who ran Merrimack Caverns in Missouri, got in touch with Dalton and brought him to Merrimack Caverns and launched a major promotional campaign trying to prove that he actually was the legendary outlaw. Dalton died August 15, 1951 in Granbury, Texas, but Terulli wouldn't let it go and offered $10,000 to anybody that could prove that J. Frank wasn't the legendary outlaw. Jesse's family members proved it, took Terulli to court and won a judgment for 10 grand. Terulli appealed and he lost. Again. So Jay Frank was a major fraud. Guess who his good friend was? Right. Brushy Bill Roberts.